Uh, Kathleen, I, am, I have I am some very more, bad at following my own rules. I have some more <laughs> suggestions for Kathleen commercials. Oh, good. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> Cotton swabs. Oh, hey, everybody. Do you want a product that you cannot live without for the purposes of ignoring every warning on the box and sticking directly inside your ears? <laughs> then buy some Q-chips. I know I'm going to because I'm out of Q-chips because I ram them into my ears all the time. <laughs> Have you ever noticed that you can feel wax inside your ears and it feels moist and sticky? I bet Left. you can now. Left. And now you're going to want to buy some cotton swab to jam them inside your ears. That's right. Roll them around and then maybe put them up your nose. I mean, not afterwards. Then you can also take off makeup, which is apparently something you can use them for. And they have some sort of dark, eldritch purpose for actual babies. But who knows? Because I've had one and I've never needed a Q-tip near her in her life. And she's three now. Cotton swabs. Don't stick them in your ears, except seriously do, because I honestly don't know what the use case is other than that. <laughs> It's true. Yep. Like wiping off makeup under your eyes and like pulling out a big chunk of earwax and being like, oh, the human body's a disgusting <laughs> miracle. Hamster barbells? <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. Soak them up for some I don't think I've ever used a Q-tip that I didn't put in my ears. <laughs> yeah. Uh, maybe Megan. Maybe. First aid. That's about all I've used them for, for yeah. like little things. People talk uh, about electronics. I use them a lot to clean. Yes, them. I've used them to clean a laptop keyboard. Yep. Mm. Yeah. Oh, you could have got all these off off box uses if you if your ears aren't aren't dirty, I guess. Yeah. But it's the, the thing is the box doesn't say what they're for. They're just cotton swabs. It oh, says, they say don't stick in your ears. It though. says yeah. what they're not. Yeah, it says yeah. don't stick them in your ears. <laughs> that, that's the thing that fascinates me most about <laughs> right. the Q-tip. Right. Is like this has got to be one of the only products out there where the primary use right. case is specifically advertised as the thing you're not meant to do with it on the box, and they don't advertise what they're actually for. Right. Well, it's got to be like a class action lawsuit, proactive defense. Like, sure. we told you not to do this. What are they for? We don't know, but not putting in your ears. People just buy these. <laughs> we don't know what they do. <laughs> I mean, and it is true, you can get your, give yourself an impaction. Like, oh, yeah. you can oh. shove that wax in there, and that's a really painful way to have it go. So, obviously, caveat. Don't stick them in your ears, but you do you. Fam. Unless you want to clean your ears. Yeah, you do. In which case, stick them in your ears. Don't. 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 Oh, yeah, the twist. Oh, Kathleen. Yeah, the twist. Oh, Ohio. <laughs> Don't kill my comms manager. That's made Jordan do a spit take. Uh, Ohio is like Ohio, except much cuter. <laughs> <laughs> We have been mentioned in several songs. <laughs> One by Neil Young, which was about something terrible that happened, but oh, uh, woo. So <laughs> to oh, no. <laughs> and, <laughs> and in the Tool song, 46 of the woo. Notable places in Ohio include Columbus. <laughs> Columbus. <laughs> And other places, Neil, but not inside one. Columbus. Kua Weave one? And Kua Weave didn't. I don't, what else is in Ohio quickly? Well, oh. maybe primaries. Yeah, that, so. was the, that was the, the, the setting of the beloved sitcom, the Woo Woo Carry Show. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I, I remember him from Woo Woo's lines of anything. <laughs> and the twice is white. <laughs> Okay, I think we're I think we're done. We're done with uh, we're done making fun of Ohio for now. Uh, I'm not saying no. 